Hey guys, let me ask few questions around the debugging panels. This is one of the topic people might like to skip it because um, people understand what they are for, but it is hard to remember, right? Uh, what is call stack panel for? What is local panels for? What is watch panel for? What is immediate panel for, right? You must have gone through it in the past, but you know, every time we might not recall the exact usage of all this okay so for that i have framed few questions this is going to help you to remember the usage okay important ones and might also help you to answer some of the questions during your exam if it appears okay so our main aim is to cover all the topics and important points so let me ask you the very first question okay so the question is if i have to see the next activity what is the keyword here next activity if I have to see the next activity to be executed, which panel should I use in the debugging mode? I would like to see what is should be the next, what is the next activity coming? I want to see. So here your options are breakpoint panel, call stack panel, locals panel, watch panel. What is the right answer? So type your answer if you know. If not, if you are uh, confused, so don't don't worry. Let me show you the answer is call stack panel okay so where is the call stack panel okay call stack okay just how will you remember this uh, call the next person if i say call the next person right call next so for a long time you can remember call stack call the next person like that you if you imagine it will be easy for you to remember for any time you have to see the next activity that is going to come in the execution this is the call stack panel we have to use and the documentation is here straightforward okay the call stack panel displays the next activity to be executed okay call the next person like that you should remember call stack panel okay call stack panel call the next person something like that okay i'm just giving you a, a memory clue uh, and its parent container when the project is paused in the debugging so next activity is the if you want to see the next activity this is the answer so the answer for the first one is this one okay let me ask you one more question if i have to see the properties of the previous activity properties of the like what is the value right what kind of uh, uh, the previous activity it has run you know what was the value of the variable what data type properties of the previous activity to be um, uh, I did not write this sentence properly properties of the previous activity which panel should i use in the debugging mode okay so here the keyword is properties of the previous activity so what is the answer here the answer is locals panel so how do i remember this locals panel so here there is something called properties of the previous activity right only input and output properties are displayed so local so uh, for example a local person would remember um the history of his neighbor or history of the you know he knows his grandfather uh, the previous property right previous uh, people in his family so we know right in a in a local area right we know each other their grandparent their parents and all that right their brothers sisters so we know about the previous generation so like that you should remember local local previous history you should know local person knows the previous history of a place previous history of a person something like that locals so that, that is how you put a memory clue so local panel where do you find in the local panel i can see the previous activity for example here you can see right um two one two three four five six value was this uh, assign properties of previous activity local panel remember local local person will know the history of a person previous history his grandparent he might be knowing a local person right so like that you should remember locals panel okay call stack panel panel means call the next person if i have to know the next activity coming then call stack panel locals panel means if you have to see the previous uh, things uh, local panel okay so there is an entire history but generally what happens if you go through the entire documentation it may happen you might not remember and get confused so i'm highlighting very important points okay now let me ask you another question if i have to see the value of few variables i want to see or i can better use the better word monitor value of few variables after each activity execution while debugging 
so after there could be 10 activities so after all the 10 i want to see how the value is changing for a variable like i want to monitor the value of few variables so which panel should i use so the answer is watch panel for that previous answer was local panel right so here the answer is watch panel so what is this watch panel let me show you watch so what is the keyword here i want to monitor i want to watch the value of few variables I, you know let's say a kid is running you want to keep on watching right how is performing throughout right so watch watch panel is for that anytime you have to monitor you have to watch few, do, throughout the execution okay throughout the execution this is what you should use watch panel so watch panel um, i'll show you the uh, proper one it can be set to display okay read this this um, read from here it can be set to display the values of variables or arguments and values of user defined expression that are in scope you can also write an expression or write a variable value for example if i go here i'll go to the watch watch panel okay i want to monitor for example here i have written output variable okay i have output variable i want to monitor throughout all the 10 activities are going what is the value of this is it changing or is it remaining constant right so watch panel is for that watching somebody right uh, throughout the journey how it is performing is it changing the value or not so this is how you should remember so when the uh, what is the keyword here when you have to monitor or watch a value of a few variable after each activity execution or as per the documentation you can you remember this it can be set to display the value of a variables variable or variables or arguments or you can also write an expression that in scope these values are updated after each activity execution while debugging after each execution it will update if it remains it will remain the same if it, the values keep on changing it will keep on updating the values okay here is the example so watch panel is for that okay so if you remember this to watch how the values are changing that should be enough okay what i think now let's move on to another question so i hope this is helping you so the fourth is the answer for this let me ask you one final question if i have to see the the word the keyword is history if i have to see the history of previously evaluated statements okay previously evaluated statements i should go for the answer is immediate panel so how do i see this if you go to immediate panel so see so many expressions are written right so what is this used for the immediate panel keeps the history of previously evaluated state what are how many statements you might have written you might written first uh, you want to see this you want to see this. so whatever you have typed it will have the history immediate panel will have the history okay the immediate panel go with the h history okay i h so likewise you should prepare some memory clues so that you can remember so let me ask you once again so what we have learned so far call stack panel calling the next person to see the next activity okay next activity then we have learned about local panel which remembers the previous history of a generation i gave you the memory clue right so here is the definition right to see the previous properties of the activity then uh, we learned about uh, the watch panel right so the uh, what is the watch panel to see i gave you an example of a child walking and you are walk you know watching throughout so to uh, there's a memory clue so that uh, likewise the variables you, if you want to watch throughout the execution every time every activity is executed and how, if the value is changing or not or it's remaining the same for that you need to use this right immediate panel what i said ih history right to whatever the you know expressions that you have written you wanted to see the history in a one given place then immediate panel is the area where you should write your expressions okay history of previously evaluated statements history of previously evaluated statements i hope this will be very very helpful for you uh, because many people will have the challenge of remembering so with this memory clues which i have given it will definitely help you to remember for a very very long time so thank you guys let's move on to our next question